All right, today is the day of our sip and swap at the sill. Um, got a few plants here that I'm going to take a cutting of. I have Monstera. This we're probably just gonna bring like this. Rubber tree, fiddle leaf fig. I'll probably cut like this top part. And then we have a whole bunch of these to bring. Um, we might bring a cutting of this big guy here, or big girl, <laughs> or um, or this. I'm not too sure yet. We'll see. But um, I'll put the camera down so you guys can see how I um, take a cutting and how I wrap them. All right. So I have some scissors that I just washed off, just so that it's clean. Um, these I don't have to cut, I'll just wrap those. So let's do this one first. I'm gonna take, I'm not prepared. Oh my God, they're so dusty. Okay, actually this is really dirty, so I'm going to put some newspaper. So I actually might separate this instead. This is, there's two in here, so I'll just take this and bring it with the root instead of just cutting it. Let's take it out of here. And a little gnat trap. We've had this for quite some time. We got it from Rainbow. Shout out to Elton. Again, our plug. You know, everybody's plug from Rainbow. Just gotta be careful with the roots. Um, hopefully Plant Man P can help me out here because it seems like we are running out of time. You know, like Tyler the Creator. Here's the roots. Because right here, it looks like it's like stuck. So I need to be careful when I split them up. This is gonna be our first sip and swap, or actually any swap in general, and our first event that we're hosting, which is pretty cool that we're doing it with one of our favorite plant shops in LA. Um, maybe we can like go to the one in San Francisco since we're always there all the time. Oh, there you go. So this one, shoot, ah. Okay, here we go. I could definitely wrap this one with, um, we have some moss, some damp moss in the plastic, as if we're like shipping them. And then I can bring it instead of putting it in like a pot or something already potted. Actually put this in a different um, pot. We have those plastic ones that we can just bring, so I'll just repot this one into one of those. Actually, let me go get one. Okay, so we have one of these. Basically, I took this one out already and I have this to bring. I'm gonna wrap it with the moss mm -hmm. on the bottom, like we're shipping it. Mm -hmm. And this one I'm gonna put in here. Okay? Mm -hmm. do you wanna do you wanna do the cuttings? Oh yeah. What do you mean? Like we can film you doing cutting this. No. This is all you These freaking gloves are huge. We are parting ways with this guy. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut 
make sure you get a note there. I don't know where to cut it, but I'm just gonna cut it right here in the middle. Or should I go down, down more? No, right here. Because mm -hmm. I think the note has to be in the water, right? right. Okay. What did you go? Okay. I don't want to leave those out like too long, so. Yeah. Okay, and then we're gonna do one of those rubber trees, an actual cutting. So I'm just gonna cut right below here. It stacks it. Are you ready for this? One, two, three. Oh! Take two, we need a freaking knife. Hurry! Do you hear that it's dripping? So I'm just gonna... And we're gonna be here till five o'clock. The heck? This is not working out. There you go. There you go. Oh! Yep. Shoot! Yep. Okay, mm -hmm. dripping. Now time to wrap. Okay. Why is there a white claw here? <laughs> hey, that's not supposed to be here. cut a leaf off, one of these stems. You put it into water and it'll root. So once it roots maturely, you can pot it into a plant and it'll get bigger. Yeah, so yeah, it just depends on what you get. Cause some of them, it gets really tricky where you have to cut it where there's like something called a node. That's the part where the stem, the leaf stem, goes, grows onto the actual like branch. You know, the cut like below it. But I mean, there are other, there are other ones that are very like easy. You can just yeah. cut it, put it into water, it'll root after, it depends. Like, after a few days, weeks, months, it takes it could take months, but from that little cutting, it will grow into something. So that's basically what what that is. Um, there are some potted plants there, and like some that already have like roots, so you can just put it into the soil. Yeah, and there are like little ones over there that are like potted. It's the purple ones. All the way down. they trail, so like they just keep growing. And growing. Yeah. Yeah. Was, Did you want to ask her about the like, like, one? Oh, oh, yeah, which one? Okay, yeah, so. Okay, so these. Okay, so they don't have roots yet. So you have to put them in water. So put them in like a jar of water. Wait till it roots. 
and then we can move it over. And like, so, yeah, and then sometimes if you see the roots, it'll grow another leaf with it. That's when you can put it into a pot. But yes, yeah. But those are really, those are like really good beginner plants. Yeah. I am a beginner. Yeah, okay, so they're really good beginner plants. Once they root, they'll... They'll keep growing and growing, yeah. and you don't the have to trim like very long. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. yeah. Literally when it's dry. Like, like uh, you don't have to water it. <laughs> you haven't watered ours in like a month. Yeah. Really? Yeah, because it, it's winter, so it's like, it's like it's still wet for a long time. So during summer, that's when you start. Like, uh, yeah, no, that's really, yeah, yeah, yeah. So just like grab a bag? So um, let me get a bag. I'm going to put some moss on the bottom. Of it, so we'll keep it moist, um, and then when you get home, just put it into water. <laughs> <I'm all awkward. laughs> I'm zooming into you, by the way. <laughs> All right, guys, it is the next day after our sip and swap event with the Sill in WeHo, Los Angeles. And it was bigger than we imagined. There was so many people. It was such a good time. It was literally our first plant swap, not only our first plant swap, but even just hosting an event in general. And a lot of people did say that uh, like the way we were doing it was completely different from what other people were doing or the traditional uh, uh, plant swap. And they enjoyed this one way more. So how we had it set up was just essentially like everything on the tables and black trays were up for grabs. You can either uh, pick one up, put a plant back, or pick one up and put one of yours, or just pick it up, everything was like up for grabs. And people enjoyed it way more that way versus just, you know, just holding your plant for dear life and just not wanting to part ways with it. So I think it was pretty uh, eventful and pretty successful. And I would love to hear your feedback from you guys, either on Instagram or on YouTube. So with that being said, let's go ahead and go over what we did uh, get. So we got this, if I'm not mistaken, this is like a, a fire pencil cactus or something like that. But we got this, I'm not too sure what this is. Looks like a bonsai, but also looks like some type of succulent. But thank you to whoever brought this because we did pick it up. And we got this syngonium, if I'm not mistaken, from Los Angeles. And this philodendron from Touch My Stems. This syngonium is rooted, so we'll probably pot this uh, sometime soon. And as for the philodendron, it is a fresh cutting. So it's not rooted yet. Let me go ahead and try to take it out of the water. So it's not rooted yet, but it is a beautiful cutting. I can't wait to see what it looks like. There's a whole bunch of new growth. All the new growth right here. So I'm excited to get that boy rooted. And we got this Ripsilus cactus from Cactus Hound. Uh, one of them is rooted. I think it's this one. Or it's, it's uh, slowly getting roots. There's this one. She gave us a whole bunch. She didn't have to do this. And what's crazy is this was literally one of the cactus that I was looking to purchase. Um, and sure enough, she comes by and she's like, oh, here you go. So she blessed us with this. And she's also on YouTube as well. So I'll put her, um, her channel link down below. Look at this. This is crazy. I can't wait. I'm going to bunch them. Uh, I don't know. If, I might bunch them all together or... Um, just separate them I don't know who knows but uh, this is also one of the plants we picked up this is from the sill and the pot is also from the sill as well and that is a wrap for today's video guys uh, thank you guys for coming thank you guys for supporting uh, we had merch available for sale and you guys uh, a lot of you guys purchased it so thank you so much we cannot thank you guys enough for that and uh, it is Super Bowl Sunday and we are going to get some wings, get some french fries and enjoy the rest of our day. Point Lady P is doing something. I don't know what she's doing. She's probably getting dressed or putting on her makeup. But with that being said, we are going to enjoy our day. I hope you guys enjoy your day as well. And we'll try to get this up Monday at our regular time, 12 o'clock. And if you are new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe. Thank you guys for attending the event. Thank you guys for watching the, this uh, 
episode, this video, whatever you want to call it. But we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.